So tonight we are seeing the moments Albuquerque police chief Harold Medina ran a red light and hit another driver this past weekend. Chief Medina says he and his wife were in the truck trying to escape a gunfire. The crash victim is still in the hospital and the alleged shooter hasn't been arrested, but the chief and his wife are both OK. Tonight we're comparing that new video to the chief's recent statement. This surveillance video starts with usual Saturday morning traffic on East Central Avenue. One man walks into frame heading east, while another man crosses Central heading west. Within about 30 seconds, they meet on the corner of Central and Alvarado. Within another 30 seconds, you can see the two men start fighting. They were two individuals. I do not know if they were homeless, but uh, they were in some type of Argument. Chief Harold Medina released a recorded statement about the incident yesterday. His wife was in his truck at the time on the way to a weekend news conference. My wife stated gun, gun. I looked up and I could hear that a shot had been fired and I saw an individual that was holding a firearm uh, pointing it at another individual who was directly in line with my wife. And I made the decision that uh, if I were to get down, I had two civilians in front of me. Uh, and that the best thing I could do was get my wife out of the way and uh, regroup and see what the best response would be at that point in time. Video shows Chief Medina in his black truck run the red light. I looked to my left and uh, the intersection was cleared. But the video shows he cut in front of another car before accelerating through the intersection. And I thought that I had uh, the car was going to pass before I got there and it did not and unfortunately I struck a vehicle. The shooting witness ran across Central to the chief's truck while the alleged shooter ran west on Central. Crime Stoppers released this photo of him yesterday described as being in his 30s to 40s with a long red beard. Police are also looking for this white truck. Uh, so I feel confident that uh, during the course of the investigation it will show everything that it needs to show uh, but once again it just goes to show how quickly things could escalate and what I got to see firsthand what our officers go through each and every day. Chief Medina also said he submitted a drug and breathalyzer test on that scene and asked for an internal affairs investigation because his lapel camera wasn't on at the beginning of the incident.